So if you have dry skin, yes, yes and it gets very flaky and itchy, you know I was gonna salve going on during the colder salve. months. <laughs> Doctors recommend switching moisturizing products from season to season. I didn't know that. This is a must. Oh, All right, I Haley? didn't include the salve. I forgot about the Sorry. salve and your love affair with the salve. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll add it to the it. web story later. But you guys know year round, you know, your hands and your uh, face, that's what's taking on the elements all year long. So that's why it's important to arm them with moisture that will create a protective barrier on your skin as we head into winter. Here's what you need to know. For daytime, Dr. John Share from Share Wellness says look for something light with a sunscreen. During summer months, gels are a popular option since they're not heavy, but he says even in winter, this is good for dehydrated skin, meaning skin that doesn't retain moisture. These often contain hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid attracts moisture and can hold up to a thousand times its weight. In water. It also gives skin a youthful look and can be used before applying lotion or cream. Thicker creams should be used before bed and not during the day unless you have extremely dry skin. If your skin is cracked or flaky, thick balms like Vaseline are a classic, but Dr. Scher says many people need to avoid this. Lots of people can develop a sensitivity to petroleum products and end up having rash like eczema type reactions. Some people swear products like this can relieve skin reactions and Dr. Cher confirms the Manuka honey can help. It's used in wound care to help heal wounds, for instance. You may consider a product containing ceramides to create a barrier against wind and dry air in the winter. And while a hot shower or bath may seem soothing this time of year, it's actually not good for your skin. Apply moisturizers within seconds after you're done to keep moisture trapped. So you also see products marketing that they contain retinol, peptides, vitamin A, C, E, D, whatever. Those aren't <laughs> necessarily dry skin treatments, but they can be found in moisturizers. So I've got details on what each ingredient can do online at click2houston.com. You'll find it under the health section. Yeah, especially here when we go from the extreme humid summer up till August, October, and right. it switches so quickly. I find my hands get fast. super dry, super Same fast. thing, for, for months at a time, your hands start to crack and mm -hmm. ache. So, um, you know, they're taking on the elements probably more so than your face because people probably remember to moisturize your face. If you yes. see flakes on your face, you don't want that. So you <laughs> fix it right away. Um, but yeah, the, the salve for the hands. There you go. I Boy, my cuticles are in trouble. That's right.